our learning intention today is the same one as the last two days. Our success criteria is to identify ways Jesus showed love to people and to break down exactly what Jesus did to show love and how it made them feel, them being the people that he showed love to. Okay, so yesterday you would have completed a role play or a comic strip or just written about some a story in the Bible where Jesus showed love to someone or to a group of people. Today you are just breaking down that story in another one. So using the table below to fill out two stories or situations where Jesus showed love to someone or a group of people. One of them can be the story you used yesterday, so you only need to research one other one. There's only two rows here, as you can see. One of them would be the story that you already um, did yesterday. So the first thing you need to include is the Bible reference. So where is it? Okay, where was this story? Which book in the Bible, which chapter and which verses? You just include that there. Here you'll talk about who Jesus reached out to. So what's the name of that person or what's the name of the group? Who are they? Their need. Okay, so um, what did they need to be done? Um, an example I can think of is when he raised Lazarus from the dead. So their need was they wanted him to come back to life. What Jesus did. Okay, so what did Jesus actually do to help or to show love? And what effect did it have on the people? So after Jesus helped and showed love, what did the people um, feel or say? So did they start crying? Were they happy? Did they just say thank you? Did they go out and preach? Um, so you need to, again, look this up in the Bible and read the verses to find out what effect it had on them. You might know these stories already off by heart. If you don't, that's completely okay. You can just use the online Bible or a physical Bible um, to find some stories. Like I said yesterday, there are so many stories where Jesus showed love and helped people because um, that's what he loved doing.